Chad, did you guys see the, uh, it's the thumbnail of the live stream, the last one? I thought I fixed it. Is the thumbnail fixed? Yes or no? Happy New Year's. Happy New Year's, boys. How we doing? We are back. Canucks scored five in the first period against Ottawa. Yeah, Ottawa, definitely tough this year, man. Tough, uh, tough year for the Sens. Yeah, I know. Why is Pekka Pass is so hot? Thumbnail's the same. It's not fixed. Not fixed? Chat, is the thumbnail of Pekka Pasta or is it the same one uh, from last live stream? Because I've had to do it twice. Why is it doing that? Leafs dominated LA. Tomorrow I'm going to the Barry Colts game. Nice. I literally, it shows me when I edit my live stream that the thumbnail I have is supposed to be Pekka Pasta on his ass. But, uh... I don't know why it's not working. Just give me a sec here, boys. Give me a sec. Um, Go to my channel. Okay, it shows it's fixed now. It's fixed. I'm pretty sure we're good. It's changed? Alright, perfect, perfect. Alright, so we are back here with Pekka Pasta in... The midpoint of the regular season, we play 27 games so far. Our goals against is 2.89. Our save percentage is 901. Of course, our record's 15.91, which is an okay record, especially for a 74 overall goaltender. Now, the Vegas Golden Knights. Vegas has not been playing too great. I mean, we came out of the gate pretty slow. We catched up a little bit, but we are fourth in the Pacific in a wild card as we are 31, 24, and 3. Good enough for 65 points. So I definitely want to uh, make that turn the record around a little bit. At least make the playoffs, especially... I mean, how many games has uh, Logan Thompson started? Who wins tonight, Toronto or Anaheim? Um, I'm going to take Toronto. 36 games compared to passes 27. So we're pretty much splitting the games. Not that big of a difference. He hasn't been great either. Arguably, you could say that I've been better than him. I also have two shutouts and a goalie goal. I want to score at least one goal this live stream. We've only had two so far the series. We are six live streams in deep. So we got to pick that part of Pekka Pass's attributes up. Thoughts on Tampa Bay. Tampa's New Year game controversial goal. That was crazy. They didn't blow the whistle though. So, I mean, play till the whistle the whistle happens. Did y'all see what uh, Nick Cousins did? Bro is a literal rat, and then he turtles. Ugh. Pretty good, but could be better. It could be better. You're right, you're right. I do think we are better or have been better than Logan Thompson. So, uh, maybe we'll get the start in the playoffs. Who knows? Who knows? Are we playing against the, the Islanders here? Okay, here we go. Game one against the Islanders. Let's start off with a bang here. First period. No score. Okay, exactly what I like. Only eight shots as well. Second period. Still no score. Okay, juicy, juicy game to uh, hop into here right off rip. Turn on the game sound. There we go. And we're good, boys. Can you do a Batman impression? <laughs> no. No, I cannot. Are you talking about Christian Bale, Batman? Because definitely not. All right, here we are in the third period up against the New York Islanders in a scoreless game in Vegas. Pasta has so far... Oh, I got to change it again. I forgot. I literally forgot, boys. The tether system has not been nice whatsoever. Um, Where do we go here? Controller settings. Hug post, manual, tether, off. There we go. Perfect. All right, here we are in the third period up against the New York Islanders in a scoreless game here in Vegas. Uh, Pekka Pass so far has been playing very good. Hasn't allowed a goal in the new year so far. Uh, I can't remember the last time we streamed past this. It would have been like a day or two before the New Year's Eve live stream. So first time seeing past in action here in 2024. Nelson coming in. Nelson. Almost sniped that. If that had hit the net, that probably would have went in. Lindholm in the middle. Easy save by Pasta. I'm not going to allow that to go in. Can you do a Mickey Mouse impression? No. <laughs> no. Is it going to be Sweden versus... Oh, my God. Is it going to be Sweden versus USA in the uh, World Junior Finals? Probably. I'm willing to bet it will be. What is the uh, matchups? 
Honestly, ever since Canada got eliminated, I have not been uh, watching. Need to fix auto tethering? I don't know why every time I do be a pro, I have to change it. Like, shouldn't I just be able to change it once and then it never change back? I, I don't know, boys. Thoughts on Team Canada? Outside of Celebrini, they were pretty garbage. And he wasn't even that great against the top talent. Or the best teams, you could say. And I mean, you can't really expect it from him. The kid's only 17. But, um... Very disappointed with a lot of players like Matt Poitras or Poitra, Fraser Minton, guys like that. I mean, nobody really. Oh my God! No, no, no! Cover that! There we go. We are covering that. Nobody was really good outside of Celebrini, especially offensively. Use a sus sound effect. There you go, brother. Was that loud enough, chat? Bedard is still eligible to play next year. Is he? Yeah, he is too. I think Hockey Canada needs to convince Chicago. No, they'll be hopefully improved next year. Maybe, who knows? Maybe they get Celebrini, number one overall. Who knows? But uh, if there was ever a year, it would be this year. And no. But there, there was no, there's no reason for him to go back. That's just going to stunt his growth. It's going to do nothing for him. It does nothing for Chicago. So there's really uh, really no point in it. No, no, we're locking in here. We're locking in. Horvat coming in, Bo Horvat. Bo Horvat absolutely snipes it on Pekka Pasta. Damn, man. He went back in forehand and it lost me. As the Islanders are going to get the first of the game. 14th of the season for Horvat. I mean, I was somewhat there. I... If I was like an 85 overall, I might have been able to save that. But at a 74, that's unlikely, man. Chat, was the sound effect loud enough? Or was it too uh, too quiet? Let me know. Think it would be good for him to go back? No. It would not be good. It wouldn't be good for anybody involved. Thoughts on Connor Geeky? He's going to be a good uh, NHL player. He was alright, but I mean, his point production was not great. He's more of a power forward, but... Nobody on the team wanted to shoot either. Everybody was just passing for some reason, and nobody could hit the net. Literally nobody. It's insane. Nobody wanted to shoot. Nobody wanted to hit the net. It was just uh, not a good tournament. Probably the worst team since 2019. And Fraser Minton, probably the worst captain. My name is Horvat, and I was so confused for a moment. <laughs> Go take out the trash. All right, we're taking out the Islanders, boys. Don't worry. As Tony D'Angelo takes a penalty, and we are headed to the PK. Not good at all after being down 1-0 in the game. Everybody's favorite player is going to take that penalty. All right, we got a lock in here. Your wife is in the DMs. <laughs> Good sound. All right, all right. I'll just leave it at, at that. It won't make it any louder. Duchesne. Oh, my God. Rebound. Pass to get up. Pass to get up. No, no, no. Good clear. Wah. Is it Wah or Roy? I don't even know. Is this Nicholas Wah? Over. Stevenson. Chandler. Or Silverberg, I mean. I got to get used to these names again. I haven't uh, been on a Vegas team in a while. What are we doing? What are, what are we doing? Uh, wow. <laughs> Over to Silverberg. Petrangelo coming in. There it is. He is going to put it home five hole as he beats Ilya Sorokin. And we are right back in this game. All tied up at one of pieces. Ninth of the season for Alex Petrangelo. How did that even go in? Just five hole beats Sorokin. Damn. That is a bad goal to let in, especially on the penalty kill. Yeah, you can't give that up, man. I think it's Wah, not Roy. All right. Perfect. You have any, app any more apple juice left? Actually, I do. I think I have like four. Something like that. Phil Hurdle got hurt. Brendan Othman got called up, which is lit. Othman's going to be a good uh, NHL player, too. He was electric uh, last year in the World Juniors. That dude can hit. He's a power forward. He finishes every single check. He'll be good for a long time. How do you feel about the Oilers winning streak? Feel good, feel good. McDavid, man, he took those uh, Tortorella comments personal. He went after him tonight. Five-point night for the Jesus. And now some people are, are trying to prop up uh, Nathan McKinnon as the best player in the world. I just think people are tired of uh, having the same person be the best player every single season that whenever another star does good, they just pr try to prop him up to be number one. Like they did with Matthews and... Uh, 2022 back door, Jack Eichel. Jesus. I thought he was going to score that. Full pressure for the Knights here. Can we get one? We're all over the Islanders. Take the lead here, boys. 
There it is, Petrangelo. Oh my God, Sorokin is flopping around. You need the, I'd like to apologize to absolutely nobody. Yeah, I do. I'll, uh, I'll definitely get more McGregor soundboards in the future, boys. Pekka is a meal in Croatia. It's delicious, really? Well, I was somewhat named after Pekka Rene, so. Can't believe what we have to have Team Canada. Okay, wait, I gotta take a minute here to read that. Connor McDavid, Nathan McKinnon, Crosby, and Bedard. Yeah, we need to get a uh, Team Canada going in uh, best on best before Crosby retires, please, for the love of God. Fraser Minton, Easton Cowan are least prospects, are they? Appreciate the sub. I don't even know where that's coming through. I turned off the uh, the alerts because this does go up on YouTube. I don't think people would uh, want to see some alerts pop up while they're watching a YouTube video. That is going to be offside. 10 seconds to go in a tie game here in Vegas. What's the meaning of give your balls a tug? Uh, you got to give your balls a tug. Exactly how it uh, how it sounds. How do you feel that Norway would have dominated everyone in the world? <laughs> uh, I don't I don't know. I don't have any feelings. And that one last rush here. Two seconds that we're going to shoot. And that's going to do it as we are headed to overtime with the New York Islanders. The win nightclub, baby. <laughs> Toronto finally won with a shutout. What overall is Pekka? He's a 74. All right, here we are in overtime up against the Islanders. All tied up at one apiece. I mean, not a bad third period. We only allowed one goal. We didn't face too many shots. We had a couple, though. But that one goal. Oh, no. Dobson coming in. No, no, no. Get out. No, you are not doing that, Noah Dobson. Get the hell out of here. He tried to go between the legs on Pekka Pasta. That is not going to happen, brother. Here we go. Eichel. Jack Eichel. Come on. Bury that, dude. Do you know there is a Matthews on Barry Colts, and I'm going to get to see him in person tomorrow. Oh, my God. I, why are we talking about Matthews right now? Oh, Eichel. Over to Foley. Somebody cut to the front of the net. We can't score if we're behind the net. Come on, Petrangelo. Over. Eichel. And Sorokin is just going to cover that up. Easy, easy save for Sorokin. Just want to let you know you're my favorite streamer. I love your videos. Keep up the good work. I hope you get more and more successful as time goes on. Appreciate it, brother. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. OT first game. How you feeling? I'm feeling good. I mean, we only allowed... Oh, that's me. That's me. I'm going for it. Oh, I'm st if I was faster, I would have got there. If I wasn't slow as molasses... Molasses or molasses? There we go. Mark Stone just in a straight line going to the breakaway. Mark Stone puts it home. <laughs> And there it is. The Vegas Golden Knights are going to win this one in overtime off a Mark Stone skate in a straight line, get a breakaway, and snipe it home. What on earth was that defender doing, man? Mark Stone just skated. I swear to God, I'm, I'm replaying this. We got to get a replay on this. Take a look at Mark Stone. He catches it in his own end, skates in a literal straight line, and just goes right by... Matthew Barzell, like that is the worst defensive coverage I've ever seen. And then beats Ilya Sorokin on the B-way. That's awful. That's bad. Love your vid so much. Nice win. Appreciate it, buddy. Does Pekka like McDonald's or Burger King? I prefer uh, McDonald's. I don't really like Burger King. They don't, they don't have good burgers. They don't have good uh, chicken nuggets or fries. I don't, yeah, I don't really like anything from there. WW. Yeah, we got that overtime victory, mate. And we are up to the trade deadline here. All right, so we're in a pretty good spot. Um, we just need to pick up more points as we go on here. Hopefully not go on a losing streak. That would be a nightmare. Paid actor? He might be, he might be. Nylander is close to signing a contract. I've not heard anything about a contract for uh, Nylander. So I will believe it when I see it. Chat, where is uh, Nylander going to end up next year? I say the Chicago Blackhawks. He's joining uh, Bedsy. Rose Roasting Burger King? Facts. Um, Okay, we're going to sim up to the Oilers. Hopefully, we can either play Chicago or Edmonton here. Start me, please. Okay, we're not playing the Oilers. 4-2 dub, though. Can we play Chicago against Bedard? All right, we have the Blackhawks at home. Perfect, perfect. All right, was there anything that I wanted to do? No, I think we're good. I think we're good. Trade alert. Chicago Blackhawks trade second round pick. 
to Buffalo in exchange for Alex Tuck? Okay. So Chicago now has Alex Tuck, boys. Did any of you guys see that at the bottom of the screen? Oh, another trade alert. The Ottawa Senators trade a second. Oh, like Blackhawks trade Alex Tuck and a third to Ottawa in exchange for a second round pick in Zub. What is going on in the NHL right now? Alex Tuck just got traded twice in the span of like 30 seconds. <laughs> That's crazy. Elliot Freeman reported that Nylander and Toronto are getting closer. They want to get it done before All-Star break? Yeah, they should have got it done before the season started. Before he uh, asked for $11 million. Have you put on an X-Factor yet? No, I have not. Do we have any X-Factors available? I'm sorry, boys, that that is so loud. I apologize. Um, Do we have any X-Factors available? We do. We have All or Nothing, and we have Sponge. Which one? Exceptional at making... Redirect, controlled save, much more likely to attempt to... Oh, I'm throwing that on. And then we'll throw All or Nothing on as a secondary. There we go. We should be able to improve in the real-time game a lot better. Thank you for whoever put that in the chat. All right, here we go. Is it wrong to be a Leafs fan? Yes. Yes, it is. How do you make a stacked franchise team? Make a lot of trades. All right, here we go, here we go up against the Chicago Blackhawks. First period... 2-1 lead. Okay, Lucas Reichel gets the lone goal on past the second period. 5-4 lead for Chicago. What happened, bro? Four straight goals for Chicago, and then we score two. Oh, I don't even know if I want to go in, chat, and just ruin my GAA. Do we go in, yes or nah? I love your vid so much. I am subscribed. Thank you, brother. Thank you. My tactics aren't working on Football Manager. <laughs> I need some sound effects to help. Crabby started the stream early. I didn't start too uh, too early. It was like 10 minutes ago. Do we go in? Yes, yes. All right, we're going in. Screw it. If we ruin our GAA, we ruin our GAA. It is what it is, boys. Yo, wife is in me DMs. Hey, baby. I'll chat you later on. <laughs> All right, here we are in the third period up against the Chicago Blackhawks. We were doing good after 20, but we allowed, I believe it was four goals in the second period, four straight as well. And we are down by one to start the third here. Not, not a great game after a pretty good first game. But I mean, allowing four straight goals in the second. That's tough, Bedard coming in. No, 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 I'm not letting Betsy snipe on me. No way, Jose. Get out of here. Do you like Vancouver? No, they suck. There you go. <laughs> Mark Stone coming down. What is he going to do? Come on, Captain Stone. He was uh, trying to rig my GAA, and there it is. Shea Theodore is going to tie up the game at five apiece. As just a flimsy little wrist shot from the point is going to go in his 12th of the season for Mr. Teddy. I mean, nice, nice feet out of the corner. And yeah, I mean, Chicago's goal, he's got to have that. That's a rough goal to allow. No screen in front as well. Beats uh, Primo, Caden Primo on the Chicago Blackhawks, who... Got Alex Tuck and then traded him like 30 seconds afterwards. What did I miss? Uh, pretty good uh, Pretty good first game. I'd say we did good. Canucks fans are more toxic. than No, they are definitely not more toxic than Toronto fans. Don't even start with that. Do you like Montreal? Eh, not really. I like their arena. I was there once. It was uh, It's a nice arena. They have very, very big bathrooms. Don't ask me how I know. Oh, no. Lucas Reichel, easy save by Pasta. There we go. No, 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 no. Get out of here. All right, there's a battle going on in the corner right now. What hockey teams do you like? Ah, the Oilers, I guess. Oh, Eichel coming in. Jack, what is Jack Eichel doing, brother? Islanders going to win it all this year. <laughs> Who's going to tell him? Somebody has to tell him, please. Don't let, don't let bro have those high hopes and just get his heart broken. Please, somebody in the chat, tell him. Me win music? Hey, yo. Hey, yo. All right, we're locking in here, boys. Not a lot of, uh... Honestly, it's been pretty rough hockey here in the third period. Just back and forth, turning the puck over. Nobody can really get anything going. Jack Eichel, come on. Can somebody shoot? Oh, my God. What what are we doing? This is worse than watching paint dry right now. Lucas Reichel coming in. I'm square. I'm square. No, no, no. He's going to feed the middle. You know he's going to feed the middle. There it is. Easy save by Pasta as Mark Stone is going to skate it out. 12 minutes to go in the third. 2 on 1. 2 on 1. All right. I mean, Barbashev maybe should have slid it over to Jack Eichel again. All right. We're getting some offense here, boys. Let's go. Give me uh, a one goal lead, maybe even two goal lead, and I will shut the door. 
tight game. I don't want to go to overtime again. Feels like we go to uh, overtime quite a bit and be a pro. At least uh, with the goalie. For sure. I don't know. Oh, he gets bodied at the blue line. Okay. Teddy in the corner. Got to move that up. Come on, we have two guys in there. There we go. Brody is going to skate it out. Up to Barbashev. Barbashev makes something happen. Shoot that. Okay, or not. Jack Eichel still on the ice. He's been on the ice for the last, like, five minutes. Great save by Primo. Primo. There we go. Leo Carlson has one career Hattie. I mean, facts. Canucks are winning it all. I don't know if the Canucks are going to win it all, honestly. I feel like they won't. Come on. No, Kurshev. Up to the point. I'm back. I'm back. Jones. Easy save by Pasta as it goes behind the net. That was a scary one, though. What a... What are we doing, Pasta? What are we doing? Oh my god, a great save again by Pasta. Shutting the door, even though he was kind of out of position there. 5.50 to go in a tie game. In the third up against the Chicago Blackhawks. Uh, I probably could have went for that. Can I hug the post, please? Jesus. I don't know why he was not letting me hug the post. If they skate out, I'm spamming that poke check, chat. I don't even care. I gotta be way more aggressive with my poke check, especially now that I have all or nothing on. Oh, that's me. That is me all day. All right, here we go. We got to get our goalie goal. Get out of here. They're trapping. Bedard and them are trapping. They are they know the scouting report right now. They're, oh, here it is. Here it is. Uh, here it is. There it is. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. There it is. There it is. There. Ah, oh, my God. I was too slow to pull him out of the net. All right, me versus Caden Primo. Here we go, Pasta. We got to smash his face in here. Here we go. Over the top. There we go. Oh, oh your wife is in me DMs, mate. She's saying, hey, baby. I'll chat you later on. Oh, no, no, no. Uppercut. Over the top. Over the top. Caden Primo. Sit the hell down, brother. There it is. We absolutely flattened Caden Primo. Chat, that probably would have went in. If uh, we weren't 300 pounds and we couldn't skate for the life of us. All right, I got to get a thumbnail here, boys. Of uh, Pekka Pasta throwing it down. With uh, Caden Primo. Can we get a good one of me knocking him out here? Is there a good one? Uh, here we go. There it is. There it is. Pekka Pasta. And uh, Caden Primo. Throwing down. <laughs> Can we get one where I landed a punch? Oh, there it is. There we go. As I absolutely flatten him. And then we skate away like a boss. You can't actually uh, celebrate with a goalie when you uh, when you win a fight. That's honestly pretty unfortunate. I wish you could Sally. All right, we... Oh, Jesus Christ, I screamed to the mic there. All right, we are back after absolutely dusting off or jerking off or... I don't even know what you want to call it. We, uh, we dominated Caden Primo in that fight. There we go, Barbashev. Two minutes to go in a, uh, a tie game. Also, four on four because the goalies fought. I don't know why they do that. Is that actually a rule? That is perfect. Not realistic, Pasta getting knocked out? Hell no. Pasta hasn't lost a, lost a, uh, a fight yet in the NHL. Korchinski. Korchinski. Oh my god, that almost went in. But Pekka Pasta, luckily, is going to save that. You can sally after winning a fight with players. You can, but not with goalies. At least, not that I've tried. I've tried, and it has never done a single celebration. All right, 28 seconds to go. We could be heading to overtime again. Oh, here we go. One last rush. Ah, Caden Primo is going to make the save. He's going to play it, though. Risky play by Primo. Back to the point, Sunquist. Okay, or not. Nah. What are we doing here? What are we doing? 13 seconds to go. One last rush for the Chicago Blackhawks. Gallinger coming in. Easy save, rebound, and Pasta makes the save again as it looks like we might be heading to overtime with the Chicago Blackhawks here in Vegas. Yo, Daddy Pasta, what's up? Hey, yo, brother. What's with, uh, call me, calling me that? World Junior should be added to be a pro. Did they update the rosters? Yes or not? Nah? Goalie Hattrick? I don't think so. Video idea, what if McDavid and Nathan McKinnon switch teams? McDavid would definitely have... <laughs> A few Stanley Cups to his name. That's for sure. All right, here we go in overtime. Again, the second straight game, we are headed to overtime. All tied up at five apiece with uh, the Blackhawks. We try for the goalie goal in the third period. 
But unfortunately, we were too slow. Oh, no. Seth Jones. Seth Jones. No, get up. Get up. Get up. Oh, my God. Get up. Get up. Get up. Oh, my. I was lost on that play. L's in the chat for that. I don't know what I was doing positionally. I was way... I was literally giving up short side because I thought he was going to give it out front. That one's on me. That one's on me. I mean, I made the sprawling save. I don't know why I couldn't get up faster. I was literally stuck. As Seth Jones is going to snipe it. Yeah, look where, chat. Look where I was. Okay, I'm not replaying that at all. We're moving on. We're forgetting that even happened. That did not happen. If anybody mentions that in the chat, ban them. Ban them. In Chicago Poverty? Uh, no. I mean, they were dominant in the 2010s. Goalie Hattie next game. Brother, I've never got a hat trick with a goalie. Most I've gotten in a game is two. L positioning. Good try. You did good. I don't think I did very good there. That was bad. I can't even lie. That was pretty bad, chat. Ah, uh, okay. That was very disappointing. It was good pass. What's going on, brother? How you? Uh, how you doing? Have you got a goalie goal? Not yet. We tried in the third period, and we would have got it if we weren't as slow as we are. See, I got to pull the goaltender out of the net, and that requires uh, skating ability, which Pasta does not have at this point in his career. We lost three straight, two overtime L's. Oh, my God. Are we playing this game? All right, we got the Calgary Flames here, boys. Must win game. Where are we at in the standings? We are sixth right now. We are out of a playoff spot by four points. Actually, no, five points. Five points. Oh, my God. Okay, we need to start winning games right now immediately. All right. Here we go. First period against the Calgary Flames. A 1-1 tie. I'll take that second period. 2-2 two, two tie. Okay, I'll take that as well. Tie game. I'll lock it up in the third. Boys don't need to worry about a damn thing. I'm also throwing on these, uh, throwing the classic and throwing the black for, uh, Calgary. Can you call your video on this chat? Chat annoys me. What happens next is shocking. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, here we are in the third period up against the Calgary Flames. All tied up at two apiece. Uh, pretty good game so far, but one of the alarming stats right now is Vegas has dropped down out of a playoff spot sixth in the pacific as we trail by five points so we need to start getting wins immediately we need a win we need to get points we can't be losing in regulation any longer all right we gotta lock in here past the noah funny business great save in the middle was that on jonathan huberto i think it was l jonathan huberto in the chat brother sucks oh here we go stone eichel Back to Jack Eichel. There it is. We take the lead early in the third off a nice passing play by the Vegas Golden Knights. Jack Eichel is going to get his 23rd goal of the season. There we go. What a nice little passing play by the computers. I mean, as nice as you're going to get with a CPU. That's pretty nice, though. Tic-tac-toe and Jack Eichel is going to put it home. Should the World Juniors be added to be a pro? I don't know. That'd be extremely hard to do. Playing be a pro while watching your live stream are great background noise. Chat, am I a good background noise? Yes or not? Nah? Is Nuge underrated? He's around uh, properly rated. I mean, he had a great season last year, even though he had a lot of points on, on the uh, power play. Still was a good season. Oh, no, we're locking in. We're locking in. No, no, no. Kadri. Kadri. Jack Eichel, skate that out. There we go, Eichel. Bad turnover there. Nazim the Dream Kadri coming in on Pekka Pass. The toe drag release doesn't get the shot off, though. I definitely would have uh, robbed him there, though, boys. Why do you not like Vancouver? Oh, uh, I don't mind Vancouver. I used to like when... Oh, oh my God. Markstrom is going to make the save. Jack Eichel is hungry for a second of the night. I used to like uh, Vancouver when Luongo played there. Definitely great background noise. Good to hear. Good to hear. I'm just a uh, professional yapper. That's what I am. Every time I miss a stream, I watch it while playing Be A Pro. Yeah, that is good, but uh, good. Oh my Jesus, that's good background noise. Besides the uh, the stuttering, Eichel, we have full pressure, full pressure on Vegas. Oh my God, and they get it out as soon as we get full pressure. Huberdo, Huberdo, still doesn't shoot. Jack Eichel is a demon right now. He he wants to make the playoffs as bad as Pasta does because he's playing like a monster out there right now. Barbashev, skate that. You got room. You got room. Go. Skate your bag off, Barbyshev. In the middle. Stone. 
The top line still out on the ice for the past eight minutes of the third period. I guess nobody wants to make a change. In the middle, easy save by Pasta. That was not going in. Not on any day of the week. No, no, no. Get out of here. I was making that save every day of the week and twice on Sundays. Barbashev. Here we go. Over. Stone still on the ice. Eichel trying to get his second of the night. Couldn't get it to go, though. Oh, turnover. Nice. Ah, come on. Stone was on that hard. Like Connor Bedard. Over. Barbashev. Markstrom's going to make the save, and he's going to cover that up. Put on your resume, professional yapper. When you stutter, say your mic is glitching. Yeah, I should say that, eh? What's the difference between NHL 14, live the life, and regular be a pro? What do you mean, like, now? Like, NHL 24's be a pro? Difference is, you could get sent down to the AHL. The, the questions were... Di oh, here we go. Oh, my God. The questions were a lot different, although I do like the format of seeing your player. Like, I, I'm glad it's like that. But uh, there was no in-game cutscenes as well. That's probably the biggest problem with be a pro. I shouldn't be getting a cutscene in the middle of a game. I don't think there's any for goalies, but for players, it's different. Markstrom, again, is going to make the save, and he's going to keep it a one-goal game. But uh, the game plays a lot better, a lot more balanced. Uh, I'm trying to think. You can request a trade. They give you uh, goals to reach every single season. Like score however many goals. Be top five in Art Ross voting or Hart voting. Stuff like that. It was just a lot different of an experience. Oh my god. Dylan Dubé. Deke at the blue line. Over. And Josh Manson is going to tie up the game at three apiece. I got over there kind of late. I will admit I was kind of late getting over. But I, I couldn't go over too soon or Dubé was just going to snipe that home. What a play at the blue line and what a pass. And that's going to be past the low blocker, I guess, because I am six foot seven. That, oh my God, past the, that, that's not a great goal to give up, brother. I like Burroughs on Vancouver. Alex Burroughs scored the biggest goal ever. I'll never forget that goal against Chicago where he walked in, clapped it top shelf. Game seven overtime. Yeah, that was a bad goal to give up, boys. What overall is past that he's a 74, I believe? You have a nice voice. Thanks. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Kadri coming in. Oh, no, the Flames have the momentum now. 640 to go in the third. We definitely got to start locking in here, boys. Are we going to go to overtime for the third straight game? We just can't win in regulation. I mean, Defender definitely shouldn't have got walked at the blue line there, but I, I probably could have had it too, so I guess it's both our fault. Silverberg, Markstrom's going to make the save, an easy save. EA needs to bring back the Winter Classic. I agree, that would be so fun. It's just a different setting to play a hockey game. I used to remember uh, back in like NHL 14, I would just randomly play the Winter Classic. I would put myself on an NHL team and play with that team in the Winter Classic against, like, Sidney Crosby in the Pens. It was just fun. And you could choose, like, different settings of the Winter Classic. Oh, no, no, no. Kadri, Kadri. Easy save by Pasta. Like, there was Phillies. There was Torontos. And then there was the classic, uh... What was it? The, the Pittsburgh one with Washington? There's three different arenas. Winter Classic arenas that you could play in. It was just a different experience, man. I don't know if we'll ever get that back. I wish we could, especially with the, uh, the... Oh, my God. No, no, no. Especially with the graphics we have now. Not saying that NHL has, like, crazy graphics, but it's going to look a lot better than it did back on old gen. We haven't had winter... The winter classic... Oh, in the middle? Great save by Markstrom. We haven't had it since, what, NHL 14? Old gen? Like, PlayStation 3? Xbox 360? It's been a long time, man. So I don't know if it's ever going to come back. In the middle... Another great save. Full pressure by Vegas, but Markstrom's holding the fort. As Vegas putting on the pressure, Markstrom is going to cover that up. Exactly what you just described was pure amazing. I agree. Back from a poop. Okay. All right. That, that's got to be one of the craziest comments I've ever seen. Imagine adding a stadium series. That'd be fun. Just to be... Oh, no. Oh, Dylan Dubé, what a save. What a save by Pekka Pasta. Oh, he's in my net. That's goalie interference ref. Call that. He's literally in my crease. What am I... Oh, no. Oh, no. Dubé. No, no, no. Get it out. Get it out, Vegas. There we go. Ten seconds to go. We might have overtime for the third straight game. Carlson, no. 
Five seconds left. One last rush. Peltier over. Easy save. And we are headed to overtime yet again for the third straight game so far. Damn, we just can't win in regulation. I don't know what it is, man. Just be able to play outdoor? Yeah, that would be... That would be nice if they brought it back. I don't know if they will, though. Every time you lose a game, you should cue sad music. I do every time we get scored on. I have two different types of... Uh, actually, no. I have this when I get scored on. If we lose, boys, if we lose, I'll, uh, I'll try to remember to play the sad music. Favorite NHL team other than the Oilers? Uh, none. Basically, the Oilers. That's it. All right, here we go yet again in overtime for the third straight time. My God, it does not seem like we can win in regulation whatsoever, man. I would like a... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I would like a regulation victory. Huberto, easy save by Pasta, and the rebound is going to go right to Nazem Kadri. As the goddamn Calgary Flames are going to get it done here in Calgary. As Vegas loses another one, and we might actually miss the playoffs. We are down bad right now. God damn, man. My defender gets run over. I gotta face a goddamn 2 on 0, and he's just like, what am I supposed to do there? I made the save. There's literally nothing I can do there. Absolutely nothing I can do. Oh my god. We might miss the playoffs. This is rough. Sad music. Two OTLs? Yeah, back-to-back -back overtime losses. If you're at gunpoint and ask who was your second favorite team, who would you say? I would say none, because I literally don't care for another team. I choose Vancouver over Vegas? Uh, bad choice. Bad choice, brother. Sign with a team that has nice jerseys. I like Vegas' jerseys. Not the, uh, the mustard ones, but the rest of them I do like. <laughs> This would never happen if you go to the... Uh, come on, brother. One, I'm probably not even going to start with Ilya Sorokin being the starting goalie. Two, um, we're probably not winning with the Islanders either. They are straight trash. Actual trash. All right, two straight wins there. Are, are where are we at here? We are still sixth. We are now two points out of a, a wild card, though, so that's good. Are we playing Dallas? Please. Play Dallas? All right, big game against the Dallas Stars here, boys. We need two points here. We are two points back of the LA Kings, but also the Vancouver Canucks have the same amount of points as us and the same amount of games played. So we need these victories. You just get the rebound. I tried. I tried, dude. I promise you I tried. All right, here we go. First period. 1-0 lead for the Dallas Stars. Not a great start. Second period. 2-0 lead. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Why? Like, what? 27 shots. They are dominating us. Oh, Jesus. Another L? Like, can we score some goals, please? All right, here we go in the third period up against the Dallas Stars. We're losing two to nothing and getting dominated. I mean, 27 shots on goal. Oh, I'm going for that. Yeah, yeah, not get out of here. You know what they say, if you want something done, you got to do it yourself. Get out of here. <laughs> what a slow turn. I'm like an 18-wheeler trying to turn, chat. Oh, here we go. Right up the middle, up the middle. Up. The ah, I got to fight for that nail. God damn it. I ruined it. I literally ruined it. All right, here we go. Jake Ottinger. Actually, Matt Murray versus Pekka Pass. I'm sorry, brother. I'm going to have to put you down. Here we go. Over the okay, nice dodge. Okay, nice dodge again. I don't know. Uppercut. Uppercut. It's cheeky little uppercut there. Here we go. Dodge. Okay. He's not going to throw. Are you going to throw? Throw, brother. Throw. Here we go. Uh, over the top. Uppercut. Uppercut again. Over the top. And sit the hell down, brother. You just got fed a knuckle sandwich. And get your wife out of me DMs. Oh my god, as Pekka Pass the flat lines. Matt Murray the fucking fool, yeah. That was a proper number 12 special, yeah. Alright, here we go. Four on four hockey now could because the uh the goalies fought in a two-nothing game. Maybe that gives more ice for our players to, to score a goal here. Here we go. Eichel, Jack Eichel, bury it, dude. What are we doing? That's not the Matt Murray you think. I know it's a different Matt Murray. I realize that uh 
earlier in the year when I did simulations and there was a Matt Murray always on Dallas, I realized it was a different one. Come on, we got to get a goal here, boys. We can't lose in regulation. We Oh, no. What are we doing? Over! I was there just in case. Maybe I wouldn't have made the save. Great save by Pekka Pass that absolutely robs him. That is highway robbery, mate. Yo, oh, you fucking fools. Oh, come on. Come on. Ah, oh, where are we? Oh, come on, boys. Somebody bury it, please. Somebody please bury it. All right. I'm, I got to get a replay on that hit or that save before it goes too far. Chat, that save was insane. Here is Pekka Pasta absolutely robbing. Who was it in front of that? Dadnoff over Sam Reinhardt, now in the Dallas Stars. Oh, it hit his stick. It hit TJ Brody's stick. Did I even make the save? I don't even think I made the save. I didn't even make the save. I'm in sprawl eagle right now. Literally doing the splits. That's crazy. Pekka Pasta is the flexiest... The most flexible goalie on earth right now. I didn't even make the save. That wasn't even a save. Not even a save. Damn. I thought I'd say that. That's crazy. All right. Sam Reinhardt coming in over Pavelski. Joe Pavelski. Easy save by Pasta. I was not going to allow that one go by me. That's an easy save. I'll make that every day of the week. And you already know. Twice on Sundays. Oh, my God. Our player just got rolled at the blue line. Carlson. Oh, my God. He ran into the broken stick. Like, you literally cannot make this up. I'm playing out here with a bunch of beer leaguers. It's insane, dude. It's absolutely insane. What do you think about Max Pacioretty coming back tonight? Hopefully nothing happens to his ACL again. He came back and got injured right away, so I'm, I'm a little worried for the guy. If it happens again, he just has to call it a career for his health. Matt Murray's going to easily make the save. 10.30 to go. Still a 2-0 lead for Dallas. What's your favorite type of ramen? I've never had ramen in my life. The sim obviously sucks. It does. But at the end of the day, Vegas has a pretty good roster. We should be able to sim pretty well, I'd say. He's injury prone? Yeah, he is. Was a good goal, good goal scorer in his prime. Sagan over Jamie Benn. Oh my god, I almost got lit up by... The former dynamic duo of the Dallas Stars. Go, Jack Eichel. Oh, Eichel coming in. Eichel! He could not be denied except for Matt Murray robbing him there. Come on, boys. Barbashev. No, 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 no. To TJ Brody. Let's get a goal here. Come on. Over. Mark Stone. What are we doing? Ben Bishop used to be one of the best goalies. Yeah, he had to uh, retire early. Well, he was a good goalie back on uh, Tampa Bay. Stone coming in. Stone just skates right into the defender. I don't know what he was trying to do there. Doesn't look like we're going to get any sort of a comeback here in the third period as our team is literally allergic to scoring goals when it matters the most. Come on. Oh, breakaway. Teddy walking in. Misses the net. Looking like Team Canada out here are the uh, Vegas Golden Knights. Uh, come on, boys. Delay penalty. Okay, we're head to the... Actually, no. We're head to the penalty kill. Who took a penalty? In the middle... Great save by pass. It's going to squeak by. Are you kidding me? That's no goal. That's got to be goaltender interference. Get out of here with that nonsense. I got ran into by Jamie Ben. Yeah, nah, that's no goal. Easily no goal. No way. No way. This is a good goal. I made the original save. I come back for the... Oh, my God. Yeah, that Jamie Ben's in my crease. That's no goal. Call it, ref. Come on now. Do the right thing. All right, there we go. No goal. That's perfect. Exactly what we needed. All right, we got to lock in here because I think we're on the penalty kill now after taking that penalty. I don't know who took it, but not a great time. Oh, no, we're five. Oh, no, we are on the PK. Okay. Penalty kill time for Vegas. We're in the offensive zone, though. Played the ref. Paid the ref. No, I definitely did not do that. Pekka Pass that doesn't have the money to afford that right now. He's still on his... Oh, no. Sam Reinhardt. Over. Pavelski. Back to the point. Heist get in. Oh, that would have been a nasty tip in front by Sam Reinhardt. Two minutes to go in the third. Down by two. Can Vegas get any offense here? Can we get a goal? Nicholas Watt trying, but Matt Murray's going to cover that up. I hate the Golden Knights. Bro, I love your vids. Thank you. I appreciate it, brother. Jamie Ben loves torturing Vegas players. What do you do to uh, Vegas players? I don't remember. I literally do not remember. 
One minute remaining. Oh, okay. What is going on here? What is going on? Uh, this glitch is back. I got to get out of here. I'm getting pulled while the other team has the puck. That's just great. That's perfect. Oh, my Jesus Christ. Tripping. Jason Robertson boarding. I literally made a save even though I was standing upright. Like, they pull the goalie, but the fact is you got to skate. You can't make a save when your coach pulls the goalie. That is 100% boarding. That's a bad... That's actually checking from behind. That's a dangerous hit there on uh, Jason Robertson. All right, we're pulled for the last 28 seconds here, boys. Let's watch it. See if we can get a goal here. 26 seconds to go. Absolute zero pressure from Vegas, even though we're down by two. That makes no sense. All right, let's just take a look in the stands. Do we have any baddies in the stands? Oh, I can't even move. Okay, never mind. Chat, do you guys see any baddies in the stands? I'm looking. I don't see any. I do not see any. I guess uh, the Vegas Strip is now populated tonight. And that is going to do it. The Dallas Stars. Dallas is going to walk away with a 2-0 victory over the Vegas Golden Knights as our playoff hopes just continue to decrease. Damn. I don't know what to say. I do not know what to say, chat. You doing NHL 14 live the live stream with Shorzy? Chat, should we do that? We'll probably end up doing that more in the summertime when there's less to uh, less to do. But uh, I'll definitely be down. We could do a little mini-series. That could be something that we do. In the summer, we do an NHL 14 Live the Life. Go a couple years with Shorzy. That could be fun. I love the Vancouver Canucks. Sorry to hear, brother. I see a baddie. Do you? Where at? Where at? Can you pause the stream? I have to pee. You realize you can literally pause the stream. You will not be caught up to date, but you can pause it. Blondes or brunettes? Uh, easily blondes. I'm a big uh, blonde kind of guy, chat. I can't even lie. What did I miss? Ah, uh, we were looking for some baddies in the stands. Unfortunately, we didn't get any, though. Did not get any. All right, let's just simulate ahead. I don't think we're going to make the playoffs. Just losing games, losing games that we need. Ah, uh, 3-1 win, but a 5-3 L. Right back where we were. I mean... Vancouver has 80 points. There's still a chance. There is still a chance they have games in hand, though, on us. Yeah, they've won game. Ah, oh, we trail the Oilers four points right now, boys. Four points. We basically need every win here. I'm going to sim this game. 5-2 dub. There we go. Anaheim, do we get a dub? There we go. We got two wins, boys. We now trail the Oilers only by two. Oh, my God. Start me against Minnesota. Please start me against Minnesota. Is 24 better than 23? Uh, uh, no. Gameplay-wise, no. Features-wise, yes. 6 nothing L. That hurts. That hurts our chances. We could have ca could have caught up to them there. We literally could have catched them there. Down by 2. Oh, Dallas. This is a big game. This is a major game. We trail right now by 2 to the Kings. No, the Canucks. Oh, my God. The wild card spot. Uh... The Jets, 85 points. Yeah. We either got to hit 85 or 86. That's that's going to be tough. That's going to be tough. Oh, no. That's not good. First period up against the Vegas goal. Or up against the Dallas Stars. My bad. First period, one nothing Lee. Jesus Christ. Second period, 1-1. One one, so we tie it up. Berard? Who is B. Berard? Brother thinks he's Connor Bedard. God damn. All right. We're throwing on, throwing the black ones. Where are the black ones at? Black, black, black. No, no, no. There it is. I like those black jerseys. Peanut on Joey. I don't know who that is, brother. No idea. Kermit the Frog impression. No, thank you. No, thank you. All right, here we go in a major game again up against the Dallas Stars. This time we're all tied up at one apiece here in Vegas. We have to, we trail, I believe, the Colorado Avalanche by three points in the central for the wild card. And I think it's Vancouver who has 86 points on the season. So we gotta we, we need to win this game. If we do not win this game, we're most likely not making the playoffs. We have to win pretty much every single game moving forward to the end of the year. Otherwise, Vegas most likely is missing the playoffs. I appreciate that. I appreciate that $2 super chat, brother. Thank you very much. D1 supporter for real. Thank you. Willie Shome. Thank you very much for the super chat. Montour, no, 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 no. Focusing, focusing. Back to Lindell over Jason Robertson. Dallas is all over Vegas right now. 
Montour at the point. They have Brendan Montour? Are you kidding me? Pavelski rebound! That could have gone in. Oh, they have full pressure. My energy is about to drain. Oh, no. Get it out. Eichel, please get it out. Thank you very much, Jack Eichel. All right, all right. Here we go. Come on, boys. Take the lead. Take the lead, and I'll shut the door. Barbashev can't get a shot off, though. Cannot get a shot off. Uh, which is more broke, the full pressure system or tethering? Tethering, I wouldn't say is broke. It's just not for me. And the pressure said, so there we go. Draw that penalty. We are headed to the power play. The pressure system has been a lot more balanced now than it was on uh, release day, but I, I still don't like the fact of the pressure system. The fact that I can play amazing defense and keep the other team to the outside for like 10 seconds and they have full pressure and they get the advantage for literally ragging the puck in the offensive zone. I literally hate the fact that that's a thing. I don't like it at all. Game sound isn't on. I got it. I got it, boys. I remembered. I, uh, I did forget, but then I looked at the screen and it was off. Oh, Dickinson. Rebound. There it is. Put it home. The Vegas Golden Knights. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Was that goaltender interference? Oh, my God. Dickinson, you ran into the goddamn post, dude. What were you thinking? Doink right off the crossbar. He knocked himself out. He was having himself a proper knock, yeah? And that's going to be no goal as we still sit at a tied game. Here in Vegas, that's not great. I thought we scored. God damn it. Oh, no. Henrique. Henrique. Good, good, good. Nicholas Wah. There it is. That's coming through now. I'm just going to mute that because it's uh, it's pretty late. Or it's pretty loud. I'm, what am I saying? Late. Sunquist? Over? I have my headphones on. That's why the game sound, or not the game sound, but the alert sounds are a lot louder. Usually I don't, but with the soundboard, uh, I've been doing it as of lately. Because the my soundboard is too quiet. But the alerts are too loud, so I gotta I gotta try to fix that somehow. I also think I need to close my window. My toes are freezing. I'm proud to be a Vancouver Canucks fan. You're probably the only one, brother. Oh yeah, that's me. That's me all day. I'm going for the goalie goal. Get out of my way. Get out of Pekka Pass's way. You guys are gonna trap? Alright, I'm the king of trap. Y'all didn't know about uh, Pekka Pass's trapping career on the streets. On the hearts. Come on, Pavelski! Come at me, dude! Oh my god, this is gonna be hard. Shoot it! There it is. Ah, oh my God. Yeah, I'm not going to get a goal when they're trapping like that, dude. There's no way I'm going to get a goal like that. How's your Christmas? My Christmas was uh, very good. Very good. Hey, turn off tethering in the controller settings. You have to do it literally every time you go in to be a pro as well. Because it resets. Because EA Sports, for some reason, cannot allow you to turn off the tethering without it resetting. That's just great. Score or no dinner? What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? Y'all rationing my food? If I don't score a goal here? That would be tough. How tall is Pekka Pass? He is six foot seven. Absolute monster. He was 6'9 last year, but I wanted to make him a little smaller. Oh, great save by, uh, I think that's Jay Gottinger in the net now, number 29. I wanted to make him a little smaller this year just because I feel like a lot of the reason some of the goals go in is because I'm so big. There we go. Draw that penalty. Draw that penalty as Vegas heads to the power play. Well, yeah, because he's so big, he's probably so clumsy that he allows too many goals down low. If you know what I mean. I thought 24 was going to be better than 23. Yeah, I did too. I say features wise, like everything they added, like in World of Chell, if you give us NHL 23 gameplay with all that. You have a much, much better game, but the gameplay is so bad in this year. I don't know what they did. I appreciate them trying new things, but a lot of the things they've tried just... It just doesn't work. It makes the experience much, much worse. Oh, here we go. Pasta. Here we go. Around you. Here we go. Pekka Pasta. Trying to snipe one in the back of the net. Get... Oh, my God. Again, who is that? Number 71, William Carlson. I'm going to beat your ass in the shower with my dick, dude. I don't even care. I don't even care. That was crazy. Oh, I just got blasted in the face. Ugh, I'm mad now. I'm mad. That was a goal. And my own teammate, they didn't do that last year. They didn't glove down your goaltender shots every year. Ugh. Over the top. No, no, no. Oh, no. Over the top. Uppercut. Uppercut. Jake Ottinger. Sit the hell down, dude. I'm in no mood for the bullshit. Ugh. 
That was a goalie goal waiting to happen if my own teammate doesn't glove it down. Like, bro, I was not passing to you. I was not passing to you. Ah, uh, whoa, you watch? What did I do? Chad, did I do something? What is tomorrow's video? Tomorrow? Team Canada is getting revenge. That's right, boys. That's right. Don't miss it. It's going to be a W of a video. Ah, uh, we're on the power play. We're not on the power play anymore. That was a quick power play. Oh, Jack Eichel. Eichel. I Jack Eichel. Shoot the puck, dude. Like, what are you doing? I, I really don't understand it. Heiskanen coming in. Heiskanen. Good D, good D. Very big D. Carlson. Oh, Carlson. I'm mad at you. I'm mad at you. Do something. Make me not. Okay, never mind. Or do that. Eichel. Rip it. Jack Eichel. What a save by Jake Ottinger. On Jack Eichel there. Goddamn. 13 seconds to go. Oh, my God. We're heading to overtime yet again. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Is this four times so far in the live stream? Put it in, put it in, put it in. Jake Otter's going to make the save. As yet again, we are headed to overtime. How are we headed to overtime again? I suggested that you make that video on Team Canada. Let's go. Well, to be real, I probably wasn't going to do it until uh, I got mad when I saw Team Canada lose yesterday. So I was like, screw it. Winner, no dinner. Look at username, pass his wife. <laughs> I wish... If I can get a wife that can cook me dinner, that it is what it is. That that's the dream, boys. This is the OT stream. Facts, facts. Should we? Did we break the record of most uh, consecutive overtime here? Clutch up, I'll try. All right, here we are in another overtime. This time up against the Dallas Stars, a one-one hockey game. Five minutes of overtime, and of course, if need be, we have a shootout waiting for us. But every oh, breakaway, Jack Eichel over Eichel. Oh my, too much passing by the boys. Way too much passing. Somebody just got to rip that home. Three on three overtime. So much skating room. In the middle, Jake Ottinger is going to make the save. God damn, I thought we were going to win there. I guess not. I guess not. I'm happy Canada lost. You are a D1 hater. D1 hater. Pass the dial in. Chat, I'm dialed in. I haven't allowed a goal this entire game. I've, I've been actually doing pretty good in the real-time game. I'll be real with you guys. The goals that I've allowed, one of them was bad. But the rest of them, I couldn't really do much on them. Oh yeah, draw that penalty. We are headed to the power play here in overtime. Jason Robertson, two minutes for tripping. Get in the fucking box, mate. That is bollocks. Win or you're a furry? What the hell does that mean? What the hell is even that? All right, Eichel, big, big draw here. You need to score. Oh, here we, here we go. Carlson, William, over. Teddy. Gets blocked. It's, oh, my God. Carlson back. Oh, Teddy, walk that in. Over. Oh, my God. Can we get a goddamn shot on Ned? Every shot's getting blocked. Again, third, three straight shot attempts get blocked. All right. Oh, oh see, you're lucky, Shea Theodore. I wanted that overtime winner. It is so much harder to score goalie goals in this game. Oh, here we go. Silverberg and Jake Ottinger is going to make the save. He's going to play it. Risky play, but it's going to work. Heiskanen up to Robertson. All right, 22 seconds to go in overtime. Need to lock in here. Need to lock in. Henrique coming in. Henrique over. Montour. Montour. Easy save by Pasta. I'm going to play that. We only got 10 seconds to go anyways. Go, Jack Eichel. One last rush. Eichel. Eichel. Over. Oh, my God. What a great save by Ottinger. Again. Again. Shoot. Somebody shoot, please. Oh my god, and we don't even get a shot off as we are headed to a shootout. What 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 was that? No shot with three seconds to go? Coley, Michigan. Have you used your trade points? It'll boost your overall. Oh, uh, I think we have. Yeah, I think we have. Big power play. Can't shoot the freaking puck. Yeah, we're just hitting shin pads, boys. Over and over again. Alright. Here we go in a shootout. You guys already know what that means. Flying poke check time for Pekka Pasta on every single shooter. I don't even care if we get scored on. That's what I'm doing. Doesn't affect my uh, goals against average, so. Jason Robertson coming in. Get out of here, brother. There you go. Give your balls a tug, mate. All right, Jack Eichel, the first shooter for Vegas. Can we get us on the board? Come on. Eichel. Eichel. Ah, Jack Eichel. Did he even hit the net? I don't even know if he hit the net. Come on. Here we go. I don't even know who's coming in. I didn't read him. And a flying poke check. Oh, no. Sam Reinhardt read the scouting report. And he's going to. Yeah, I mean, backhand, forehand. I was close. 
but not close enough. I was way out of my net. I gotta be a little more patient with it. If they're gonna shoot that far out, I should be able to make the save. Carlson coming in. William Carlson, there you go. He ties it up in the shootout. William Carlson gets one. Nice little, eh, there's a backhand forehand, just like uh, Sam Reinhardt did on us, so can't really complain. All right, Joe Pavelski. We gotta make the save. Joe Pavelski, get out of here. Flying poke jack on ya, mate. That's done. Mark Stone's gonna fucking finish it here, yeah. Come on, Stone. Stoner, oh my god, Mark Stone, what are you doing? That was a terrible shootout attempt. Miro Heiskanen versus Becca Pasta. No, 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 Heiskanen, you wanna come in? Heiskanen, Heiskanen is gonna come in, put it home as the Dallas Stars. Oh no, they might take this one in a shootout. That, that one was bad, I'll admit, that one was really bad. How did I not poke that from him? All right, number 27 needs to score here. Shea Theodore, I believe. And he does not get it to go as the Dallas Stars are going to beat the Vegas Golden Knights in a shootout. And that pretty much puts our uh, playoff hopes to bed as I got to watch Jake Ottinger goddamn just absolutely ruin me with that celebration. At least he didn't do it with the gritty. If he did the gritty, I might have just retired right then and there, honestly. Oh, no. You'll get a point if you lose. I'm aware, but we need multiple points. We we literally cannot afford a loss. We need to win everything. We're not making the playoffs, chat. I'm going to be real. Still have a chance? You got a point? No, we're not, we're not making it. No way. Unless we win every single game? I don't think so. Knights are the best? Not right now. Past this chili, a WRL dinner. Ah, uh, personally for me, I've never had chili. I heard it makes you uh, gassy. And uh, that would not mix well with me. My goal would be pro after shutout loss. Swayman gritty on me. Chat, how do you gritty? Can I get Pekka Pass at a gritty after a win? That would be great. You know there's an NHL rule where if you pull your goal in OT and lose, you get no points? Really? Damn. Who will win the Stanley Cup if you sign with the Canadian team? Gary? Oh, who will win? If I, You mean I will win if I uh, sign with the Canadian team. All right, we're not playing back-to-back -back games. Pekka Pass is a workhorse. 6-1-L. Damn. 83 points we need 88 yeah things are looking pretty grim here boys sim that game against washington 6-2 w but i think it might be too little too late here golden knights 85 points we need 90 to get in we can all yeah that's it our playoff hopes are done bye bye playoffs are we gonna start in the very last game here can we start in the very last game oh okay coach you're not even gonna start me in the last game of the regular season that's crazy, yo. That's insane. Coach isn't going to start me in a game that doesn't even matter. Don't get me experience. Nothing like that. Literally just sit me on the bench for the final three games of the regular season. No wonder we missed the playoffs. All right. Last game of the regular season. We are going to lose 3-2 to two in a shootout loss to the Anaheim Ducks. My former team. Damn, man. Damn. Worst coach. We missed the playoffs, boys. We missed the playoffs. Let's go and take a look at the playoff matchups here. Move teams? Now nah, I'm not abandoning teams just because we uh, we didn't have a great year. Chat, uh, I gotta be real with you. I'm tired of just flip-flopping on different teams. I'm gonna stay here for a couple years. If it goes bad again next year, then we might think about it. Right now, I'm chilling. I think our contract's for multiple seasons as well. Um... Here is the playoff matchups, boys. Pittsburgh and uh, Montreal should be a good series. Toronto, Florida, that'll be good. Devils and Rangers, that'll be good as well. Dallas and LA is an interesting series. Vancouver looks to dominate the Anaheim Ducks, who made the playoffs again. Maybe we shouldn't have left them, boys. Maybe not. God damn, that's tough. That's tough. How long was your contract? I'm gonna check. I don't. I think it was a two-year contract. I don't think it was a one-year one. Uh, let me check here. Pack of pasta. It's a two-year deal, so we still have one year left on our deal. So we cannot leave in the offseason. What do you think of the Coyotes? Poverty franchise. Literally the definition of poverty. If you search up poverty franchise, the first team that comes up is the Anaheim Ducks. I mean the Arizona Coyotes. Why did I say Anaheim? That, that's crazy. What do you think of PWHL? I watched some of uh, the game between, was it Ottawa and Montreal yesterday? I watched some of it. 
it's good for the sport. Hopefully it uh it stays afloat. I know the WNBA has a lot of problems. They have a, a lot of their funding comes from the NBA. So uh hopefully PWHL does well revenue wise as the Winnipeg Jets are going to go on and win the Stanley Cup. Are you kidding me? The Winnipeg Jets win it in year number 2? All right, let's take a look at the uh the awards here. First, let's see who they beat in the Stanley Cup Final. More importantly, the Jets beat the Tampa Bay Lightning in seven games in the Stanley Cup Finals to win their very first Stanley Cup in franchise history. Sign with the Pens next season? I'm good, I'm good. The Nikita Kucherov Nikita Kucherov's going to have a year for himself. The Ted Lindsay, Maurice Richard, Art Ross, and Hart Trophy. The Norris is going to go to Quinn Hughes. The Lady being Nicole Caulfield, the Calder to bend over on the Montreal Canadiens who actually made the uh, Eastern Conference Finals. The Conn Smythe is going to go to Nikolai Ehlers, the Vesna to Jonathan Quick, and the Selkie will go to bend over of Montreal. So, bend over having an immediate impact. Jonathan Quick won another Vesna trophy. Isn't he like 40 years old at this point? That's back-to-back Stanley Cups for Winnipeg? No way. It is, too. The Jets are a dynasty, boys. They're a dynasty. They are a dynasty. Both years so far in the simulation, they have won the Stanley Cup. They're absolutely insane right now. Signed with the Seattle Kraken. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. He's on the Kings, too? Who's on the Kings? Oh, yeah, Jonathan Quick. I, I don't understand that. That's crazy, man. Um, I guess we'll just simulate to the next season here, boys. We will simulate to the next season. If Mr. Ben is here, then so is Shorzy. I mean, that doesn't really prove anything until we see Shorzy. I'm staying up till one to see the new Chell shop. Honestly, for the last like month, the shop has been terrible. It's just the same three things recycled. It seems like they ran out of ideas. Maybe it's just me. I literally bought everything. In the store for the first like month or two months. So I have everything, but it's not good, not good. Alright, let's go look at Pekka Pass's stats for uh for last season. We didn't check it out. Oh no, we're not gonna be able to this way, huh? Actually, first let's take actually no, we'll take a look at the stats and then we'll take a look at the lines. I have to go in uh reverse order here. Goalies. So, Pekka passed it in his second season in the NHL. Played 38 games, going 18, 14, and 4. Two shutouts, not great save percentage, and not great goals against average. Honestly, worse than last season, despite the fact we had one more shutout. Still a winning record, though, but yeah. First season with Vegas was not the greatest in the world. We definitely have to improve off of that. Still only 20 years old. Tons of room to grow. We are now a 76 overall minor backup goalie with high elite potential, so... Hopefully we turn the ship around. And here we are after the offseason with the Vegas Golden Knights. It doesn't look like too many changes have been made here. Still have Barbashev, Eichel, and Stone. Kyle Pose is on the team. Carlson is still here. Nemestikov is on the team. Our third and fourth line doesn't look too great. Defensively, oh my god, defensively. We lost Shea Theodore and Alex Petrangelo, and we picked up Aaron Ekblad. <laughs> That is a major L. A major, major L. And uh, in goal, we still have Pekka Pasta and Anthony Stolarz, who's an 81 overall, so we might actually end up being the starter for Vegas this season. That's not good. Defensively, we're definitely not as good as we were last year. Uh, we have five trade points. we got to put them into something here. Um, five, I, no, speed. Where's my speed? Athletic speed. Uh, there it is, speed. I'm bumping up my speed, chat, so I can score some goalie goals. I don't even care. There it is. One TP available. Put it in uh, durability and endurance. There we go. Well, your defense isn't good? Yeah. Yeah, Major L just like my... Hey, yo, brother, calm down. Calm down. <laughs> okay. All right, boys. I think I'm going to call it there. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Pekka Pasta now heading into his third season. Hopefully, we can rebound off a not great second season with Vegas. I'd like to say thank you all for watching. Don't be silly.
Rappy Willie. All right, boys, join the uh, Discord. The link is in the chat. Also, subscribe to the channel for more live streams and videos. We also got a video going up tomorrow, 4.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Don't miss it. Join Discord. I'll be in there. And, yeah, we should be back either maybe tomorrow or the next day with Shorzy or Packet Pasta. Who knows? All right, see you later, boys.